baby, what's going on? We are here for Tatanka War Eagle. That is not a fart, that is just my seat moving. Why it won't do the fart noise? Don't you hate that? He's like, I didn't fart. Anyway, <laughs> he is an aggressive acrobat. Let's just be clear, man. As a child, Tatanka was one of my favorite wrestlers. Tatanka, I never thought I would see the day when he would be in champions. Training ability all the way at 26k. Yellow submissions do 100% more damage per turn. Yellow moves start with two more move points. Uh, new gen link, million dollar cooperation link. I did not know that. Uh, he has no other gear. Turn around for the crowd, Tatanka. Ooh, look at the hair. They got the hair. Okay, I'm here for it. I don't know who that face is. But that's the, he looked like um he looked like one of them little baby dragon baby um Goku in the early eras of Dragon Ball. Anyway, let's look at the moves. End of the trail, uh finisher deal about 169k damage and choose a three by seven area to ooh, to swap into red gems. Leaping shoulder block deal about 73k damage and choose a two by one area to make into two turn juggernaut gems. That will make 10 random gems into color turn gems on every countdown turn and make 18 color turn gems into black gems at the end of the countdown. Drip plate will not work on that. Power slam deal about 115k damage and choose 5 gems to make into blue gems. Neck breaker deal about 101k damage and choose 1 rose to make into 1 turn countdown gems that will deal Ooh, 51k damage and make four random gems into multiply gems of strength five. Oh boy, that sounds very delicious. Pendulum Batbreaker deal about 101k damage and force your opponent to skip their turn for one turn. Vertical Chop deal about 44k damage and increase your black MP by four. It's a one charge move, yo. Diving Chop deal about 75k damage and make 24 multiply gems into red. And finally, Knife Edge Chop deal about 84k damage and increase your black gem damage by 75% for two turns. He sounds like he has a lot of builds and I am excited to get into it. So uh, let's do this thing. If this is what 100% chance of black gems on the initial board looks like, I don't want it. I do not want it. This is uh, this is a 100% chance fam. I've... <sighs> This, this one is for the birds. This one is for the freaking birds. I've seen boards with it where it started with like plenty of gems. All right. You're gonna skip this fool for one turn. We're gonna put down another set of uh, juggernaut gems. Right now, black gems are doing 11K. I guess he has metals on. Seamus has metals on. Increase it by how much? 75% right now they're doing 20k gonna make one black gem match oh god he's gonna kick out but he's gonna be stunned though are we okay with that he's gonna be stunned the umptious biff bam boom take him to the moon not enough to write home about so what I'm thinking is I should start with a legit black MP trainer. Uh, that's the beautiful thing about color turn gems. They can help you with a jam, in a jam. I'm gonna start with a black MP trainer and then I gotta figure out a way to be able to, um, hmm, thinking, thinking, thinking. I think I have an idea. I think I have an idea, oh God. Doing the most right now, sir. You're doing the most right now, sir. Stun for one turn. Uh, he gonna hit me with his sub again. The oh god, somebody said Davy boy. Look at God. But the black gems go off. Boom! 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 Boo. He gonna hit me with his sub. I'm thinking. I think I got an idea. I think I got an idea. It's a four turn sub. Uh, I ain't gonna hold you. I'm gonna come back when I got the next build. All right, so I switched things up. I brought in um, 
what's this lady's name? Whoever she name is. 50% increased black gems on initial board. Charge moves by two. Um, woods. Black moves start with four more move points. Um, giant increased chance for 50% more black gems on the initial board. And Elias charged black moves by one more move point. Now that I think about it, Elias is probably irrelevant because I have her who charged moves by two more move points. So I could have probably left Hogan on. Now that I think about it. But I am trying to... And there we go. Have everything ready to go turn one. Then match another black gem and charge the finisher. The, not finisher. The... the Whatchamacallit. The skip turn. So I, it can fire off again. I am, I'm losing my words, but you get what I mean. So right now his black gems are doing 14k. Increase it by 75% for two turns. And they are doing... Uh, 24k. Hit this. Oh, well, ugh, there's, ouch. There's that. There's friggin' that. Doing too much. Let's try again. Skip again. I think this is it. You want, you want to be able to have those moves refilled. That was the problem before. They weren't refilling quick enough. And then increase black gens by 75% again for two turns. 35k match this and now at this point everything should be oh yep filled up again but i want to find a way to be able to stack at least two skip turns but i don't feel like i am able to see that right now maybe not with this build maybe with another move i think i've been on this build entirely too long Let's get into another build. Another build. Keep it ill. Another build. With a simple three match, all of my moves should be filled up. An easy peasy lemon squeezy three match. Yup. Easy peasy lemon squeezy three match. All the moves are filled up again. There were no cascados. Maybe this match would have been over. Increase again. Do we have any more black matches? We do not, but thanks to the power of color turn gems. Actually, I could have also put, now that I think about it, color turn gem. I gotta do this build again. Now I gotta do color turn gem trainers and coaches. I, I literally just thought of that. Please forgive me. I thought we were done, but we gotta do this build again. All right, we're about to cause all kinds of problems. We got um, Ken Shamrock, Technician Shamrock. Color gems do 100% more damage. He's a trainer. Coach Hall of Fame Brett, color turn gems do 50% more damage. Coach RVD, color turn gems do 2200 more damage. And of course, Xavier Woods, Black MP, start with four more MP. So we are, this is gonna be a lot beefier than before when we were just focusing on black gem damage which was my bad i have done your disservice which was my bad fortunately there's no black gem matches so we're gonna go with that regular black gem 24k colored Ooh, child oh child Oh, child. You're gonna match red. To be honest, look at look at this guy. Look at this guy. Fill the board, board not fill the board, but you get the idea. I guess with double fury, that's gonna be a problem. We're gonna let him put in his work. We're gonna let him cook for a little bit, and we're gonna check. Oh boy, he's like I'm playing no games. It's like, I'm playing no games, baby boy. It's like, I ain't playing no games. Uh, we're gonna skip this fool again. That's the downfall, not having any black gems on the board. Uh, no black gems, I'm gonna cover his multiply, guys. Increase my black gem damage with two turns. 
come on, baby, come on, baby, come on, baby, come on. Skip, skip. Uh, let me get a number two. I guess if you had a strap plate on in match blue, get black MP. That will work. Give me a strap plate, a skill plate. Match blue, get black. What sucks is now that when I want to use my juggernaut gems, they worked on the kick out, but I don't want them for the kick out. And then they turn my black gems, the color turn gems, just turn them into other gems. So therein lies the problem with color turn gems. I ain't gonna hold you. Let's get into another build. Obviously, I'm a glutton for punishment. I decided to forego the move that um, increases black gem damage and just use the increase my black MP by four move. Um, because it's a one charge, all I gotta do is match. I don't know. I'm just sincerely a glutton for punishment. Increase that. Damn, that chop, that chop was kind of disrespectful. I ain't gonna shoot your heart when that chop was disrespectful, fam. Right, did that. No black matches, but he's gonna be skipped. And my thing is a one charge. Ugh, hold on. Baby, we cooking. Baby, we cooking. Hold on. Somebody said, Davy D, baby boy, we cooking. Hold on. Oh boy, hold on. Uh, in case y'all don't know, this is the same squad. Color turn gem damage. We just uh, replaced the increased black gem damage with the increase red MP. Alright. Fill the board. The entire board should be filled. No? No, I made that up. I made that up on my own accord. Looks like we got our first 1 million damage, 1.2 mil. So including the red move is a better look. Now I'm gonna try that again, but instead of the skip turn, I'm gonna include the move that increases black gem damage. All right, no more um sob. I mean, no more skip. Increase. Sorry, not increase. Put it down like Charlie Brown. Now we increase, increase the peace. Uh, put that boy there. Put that boy there. Make sure he doesn't have any green gem matches or black gem matches. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Look at this guy increase yeah this might not be the bill this might because he he already ready to go all right right now black gems are doing 65k I hit this again and black gems are doing 93k fortunately for me what what is dude gonna do Destroy three random black gems, mix his random black gems with the multiply gems of strength six. And of course he's gonna pin me. <sighs> and then my black gems are gonna go off for the kick out. I just, I just don't like this. It, I'm gonna just call it. I don't like this build. I'm just trying to make it work for the sake of making it work, but I don't like the, ugh, ugh. I'm not a fan of it. I'm really not a fan of it. Really not. Yeah, it's in the words of Simon Cowell, it's a no for me. It is a freaking no for me, dog. I mean, it's good when you need to kick out, but then what I'm gonna do? There's literally nothing here for me to, to destroy, and he is all charged up. Alright, next build, man. Hey baby, what's going on? This is Davey D, you know the vibes. And if you're feeling what I'm dealing, 
then just go ahead and subscribe. All right, all right, we're gonna go red, double blue, choose five gems to make in the blue gems, then make a row into count on gems that will make uh, four random gems into multiply gems of strength five. Then finisher, choose a three by seven area to swap into red gems. Um, The squad, start with four more red MP to get those blue gems out. Matt Hardy, multiply gems, increase their strength by two. Hogan, um, start with one more remove point. Any color gems do 2200. And Hall of Fame, Snoop, red gems do 20% more damage. Now, if you don't have Matt, which I know a lot of you don't, you could also go with, if you happen to get him, Lex Luger. But it will increase the strength of your multiplied by one. And blue moves start with two more move points. I forgot, I think it's um, Trickster Rock that increased multiply gems by one more. So if you're fortunate enough to have him, these will go up from strength five to strength eight, two for Matt, one for Rock. Or if you just have Rock and somebody else that makes one more multiply gem strength, then it will go up to six. But um, yeah, let's see how I do. All right, first things first, you want to set out this row, this riggedy row of uh, color turn countdown gems, sorry. Uh, this build would have went great with um, the Z plate. I forgot to show you what the Z plate does. Choose five gems to make in the blue. Let's go one, two, three. Uh, I think that should be enough. Two, three, three, boof. Uh-huh, lovely. Make another row on the road again. Make another row. Uh, I'm scared for this three match. I'm very scared for this three match. So I'm going to listen to my brain. Ugh. And we... Oh my god. Someone please call 911. Bruh. Now, now we cooking. Now we cooking. Ugh. 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 Nastardo. Nasta. That's what we've been looking for, fam. That is the kind of problems we've been trying to cause. Nastardo. This build, I feel, is a little redundant because we have replaced the finisher with this move that makes 24 gems into red gems. The finisher made a three by seven area into red gems. So we're basically um, adding three more red gems. Three by seven is 21, this one is 24. So like those three gems could make you or break you, but honestly, I feel this is a little bit redundant, but okay. Let's see what we can make of it. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, and put one here, no, put one, uh, God, jeez, there's so many ways this could go wrong, Lord, eh, whatever, oof, biff, bam, boom, put it down, on the road again, ah, uh, ah, uh. Hold on, fam. Hold on. Make 24 into red. He has 2.2 million health. It's a, it's a, oh, it's still nasty. I was going to say it's a little bit more frenetic, but it's still nasty. Ugh. Somebody called the doctor. He needs disinfection. And we call this build because why not? Uh, triple blue, him triple. Keeping it true with triple blue. Um, instead of multiply damage, I've decided to go with blue move damage. Lawler, blue moves start with four more move points. Sami Zayn, blue moves do 45%. Becky Lynch, blue moves do 35%. Elias, blue moves do 30%. I believe once he gets to six star bronze, the blue moves will do, the blue finishers will do 50% more damage. 
So you can see we went from 75, 101, 169 to 135, 182, 356. As you can see with this build, the finisher is not ready to go. Um, I do not know, besides the Z plate, I do not know what skill plate I would use with this one. Uh, probably also the pyro plate. I believe the pyro plate is make multiply gems, increase blue gem damage by 50%. But maybe not pyro plate because I'm going to be destroying red gems. So there, there's that. Match this. He gets to play. He's going to destroy his black gems. And... So I guess at least with this build is great on the kick out because you have a lot of multiply gems to choose from. I make a whole bunch of them red. As you can see, they're times five this time instead of times seven. Strictly going off of blue move damage. It's still beefy. It's still beefy. A little light on the protein, but it's still beefy. So that's Tatanka. I personally would stay away from the triple black unless you find a way to make it work. I would go with any of the red double blues, uh, triple blue if you must. I mean, actually, let me try one more thing with triple blue. Okay, um, so this is what we're gonna do. Lex Luke, old school. Lex Luger, blue move start with two more move points, increase multiply gem strength by one. Matt Hardy, increase multiply gem strength by two. Hall of Fame, Snoop and King Macho, red gems both increase by 20%, so that's 40% more red gem damage. Um, This is definitely going to be turn two, I would believe. And then also, let me see what skill play I could put for destroy red. Um, destroy red and make blue into purple. That's a hard nah. Uh, is there anything else? Let me see in use. Destroy red, get yellow. That's a nah. Literally, the only thing is, is Z plate. It seems like Z plate when you make four or more countdown gems. Increase your gem damage by 50% and reduce opponent's gem damage by 35% for two turns. So that's like literally the only thing that looks like it would work with this plate. All right. The beautiful thing about this board is that we have blue matches out the gate. I'm not going to hit that four piece blue match because I want to leave as many countdown gems on the board. Cause that'll be gonna cause some problems. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes, do what you need to do, pimp. Do what you need to do. Oh come on, dude. You just sorry, hit the mic. You just took a you stupid idiot. You stupid, stupid idiot. Took a freaking bunch of my things, man. All right, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna put them down again. This is life. It doesn't always go how we want it. You can see we have multiply gems of strength eight. God, dog. All right, hit him with the dogs. Biff, bam, boom. This is a baby amount of damage. I gotta run that back. In the words of, words of Goldie, I gotta run that back. All right, let's try that again. Follow your nose. Try that again. Fortunately for me, he has, oh wait, hold on. He has no uh, black matches. Biff, bam, boom. Oh God. Match that green, you idiot. All right. Da, 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 da. Da. Do I want to put this out now or later? You know what, David? Should I hit the finisher? Uh, I feel the finisher is more controlled in terms of the red gems I can get. Two multiplies. Yeah. I feel like it's more control. This is nasty. It's nasty. I'm preferable to red double blue myself. But anyway, that's Tatanka. He is the chase character this month. 
Uh, forgot the name of the MLC, but don't hold it against me. Oh. Make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe. Your boy trying to get to, to 5K subscribers, baby boy. Help your boy out. Like, share, and subscribe.